First of all, the fight was not faked. Francis Ngannou was knocked out cold. Anthony Joshua is ranked number one in WBC rankings for a reason. Francis Ngannou has just started boxing with two fights under his belt now. Anthony Joshua has been boxing since 2007 with a total of 31 fights, 28 wins, 3 loses and 25 wins by knockout. Francis Ngannou has no experience in boxing. The fight only lasted for two rounds because he was boxing with one of the best in the business. Ngannou was stepping in Joshua's world. Recall Floyd Mayweather's fight with Conor McGregor, we all know who won. The boxers always have an advantage over MMA or UFC fighters. Ngannou left the UFC to focus on his boxing and MMA career. He signed with the Professional Fighters League which rivals Dana White's UFC. It's estimated Francis Ngannou walked away with $20 million from the fight at the Kingdom Arena in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. Compare that to the largest sum Ngannou ever received which was $600,000 for facing Cyril Gane in what ended up being his last outing under the UFC banner. In just two fights in boxing, Francis Ngannou has made an estimated $30 million. Sums he would never earn in UFC even if he fought for the next 15 years. Anthony Joshua went away with $50 million.